So off we go then. Well, he's a little fella, Ludovic Juli, but he is one of those, Jim, appreciated by those he plays with. Yeah, there's no doubt about that. For me, the perfect go-between player in that final third who links up midfield and attack. One of those nightmare scenarios for defenders not wanting to follow him into deeper space. Because he's just so bright, so intelligent. Yeah, well, usually he's looking to drag them out of position, and he's so good with his technical ability and, and vision that all of a sudden they've got a big problem. You want him in your team. Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Gets it into the middle. Oh, he really got hold of that. I think he'll be really pleased with that effort, given he was slightly off balance. Looking to get within range. Speculative strike, and that is faded wide. Oh, he really caught hold of that one, but the direction could have been a bit better. Quite. Tries to hold on to it, but he's not having it easy. Is there any support? He might not need it. And somehow it stayed out. Not a lot more he could have done with that one. Great try. Gets rid without sophistication. Another five minutes remaining before half-time, and the game is tied. And he's been judged offside. Look, Peter, this just needs a little fine-tuning, and obviously fast. <laughs> Driving on, he could shoot here. And he's done very well to deal with it. Surely this is the last chance now. Whistle's gone. That for offside? Yes, it is. Of a whole host of players queuing up to run beyond the high defensive line. And there's the end of the first half. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Well, I think you have to say the scoreline is a bit flattering because they're just not using the width of the pitch. It's all too narrow for me, and that must change. Well, improbably, an entirely one-sided game, still up for grabs. Nothing to show for all the pressure. That gets things going for the second half. Well, the first half was tight. I wonder will the second be any different? surely oh taken with style the breakthrough arrives at last 
Well, that run was all about great decision and great drive. And they say that dribbling is a dying art. Well, not in that evidence. Delightful ball. He's left his man. Goal! A two-goal cushion! And it's looking safe. He's so lethal with that right foot, and he's proved it with that goal. And it's kept out by a stubborn defence. And that's sprayed out wide. With a gorgeous ball to set up the chance. Pity it's been wasted. He did brilliantly to get a shot away from there. Already making their first change. Not what was planned, I don't think. Now the pass. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Sticks it away. And the lead is three. It is surely done. Really solid football. What a pass and what a way to round it off. Great goal. Rekic. Passes it through. Has it out wide and in space. He's taking on the lot of them. Back of the net. And that could well be the winner. That was a great run off the ball to latch onto the three pass, and he was so composed in beating the keeper. Well, they've broken out here, and this could be the moment. Oh, that's brilliant! And with the match still in its infancy, they are easing away. Look, that was it. Just have to run down the clock. Kiko Femenia. Yeah, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Well, there is a perfect illustration as to what can happen when an attack breaks down. And he scores! What more they've done it! They just will not lie down! Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. 